Hello YouTube, there's no real guns in this video. This video is airsoft products showing fake guns. It's made in a safe environment and everything's controlled. I'm not promoting the sales of firearms or any kind of stuff related to that subject. Anyways, enjoy the video. Hello YouTube, it's finally time to show something new and fancy, something red from Max. Look here, Max is developing this and they want me to test it out on MTW to see if I can break it and if it's actually useful or not. Well, you know, they obviously sent me two versions, they sent me a red and they sent me a black one and I'm going to test it out and I will show you guys how to install it. So far, this has been working very well, I like it. Um, both side works, it's ambi, very nice, very easy to install and it's great success, I like it. Let's test it and see how you install it. So we're going to install the black version. This is not the final packaging, obviously. Um, when Max sends me something, this is like an alpha, alpha version. It's, it's like it's not going on market yet, but if this works, um, they'll do some changes to the packaging, all that stuff. But I'm gonna be put a black one. Let's see how it looks. Um, I'm gonna change it out on my new MTW. I have the forged uh, tactical. Um, this is very easy to fix and change, by the way. This is how it looks. Like this. It's ambi, um, ambidextrous, just as it should be. Um, it's gonna be sitting like this, actually. So, yeah, it looks pretty good. I like it. I like most things max. I use the max triggers. I use the max hop-up unit. Like, I like max myself a lot. So, yeah, let me show you guys how to install it. It's kinda easy. This is the stock Mac release on the MZW. As you can see, these two are very different. This has this on this side. So to have an easy install, like when you remove this, the best thing is to remove this part. It's very easily done. Um, you just screw the two screws off. I have tried to play around with the spring that comes with the MZW and the spring you get from the Max one. Um, I would say and advise you guys to use the max spring, the one they give you. Um, it seems to work better with the whole system. And when you install this, there's something very important you need to learn. That's something I need to learn. As you can see here, right here. Um, can you see this actually on the camera? There you go. Uh, this part, this needs to be flush with the tip. If this is not flush, is it, it doesn't get far enough into the gun and it's not going to be functioning and this is going to be very weird and clicky if you get this completely flush with the tip then it's going to be perfect let me show how to remove it from the gun so as you can see on this mzw it has the stock mag catch mag release i guess what you call it mm -hmm. i'm not a gun tech or a tech so i don't know what all these things are called but the best way to remove this is to push this in i found it's easy to push it in with something like all the way Let's just try with the, like this. See if we can do it with my finger. You push this all the way in. You can see this goes out on the side. Then drag it all the way out like this. Spin it around. Yeah, obviously I said you need to use something to push it in. I didn't do it. Now I use something to push it in. Then you spin it like this. There you go, it's out. The spring, we have this part, we have this. And then there's gonna be a spring inside. The spring is sitting on this side, over here. The spring is going to be right here, in here. Uh, now we're going to take the max. Then you're going to take the spring from the max. You're going to insert it into the thing. There's like a clear way where it fits. Like it fits very clearly into this, this thing. Like it is very hard to do it wrong. Then you're going to turn it around. Maybe the other way, I guess it doesn't really matter. There's only one way you can install this. This Mac release, like it's it's pretty much impossible to do it wrong. I say that now, just watch me do it wrong. Then you're gonna hold the Mac release on the other side. We're gonna screw this on. And as I told you, this has to be flush. It's very important it's flush with the thing. Like it's flush, otherwise it's just not gonna fit in it. And the best way is to push this in now all the way in, all the way in, and then just spin this around. You see now, it's a flush. No, as you can see, it's very far away from being flush. So we push it through even more. I will use something to poke into it because it's very hard to push through. Let's try now. Is it flush? Yep, it is flush, as you can see. It's flush with the thing. 
So that means we're gonna take this and put it back on now. It's very important you do that it's flush because otherwise it's not gonna go in properly and it's gonna be very weird and sticky. So when this top is on, it's like it has a cap of how much you can push it in. So obviously you're not gonna be able to push it in enough. So that means you're gonna have like a sticky, like you know when you make a keyboard for example and you have sticky keys, when it's not fully inserted or done correctly, you're gonna get exactly the same syndrome here. You might ask me, what colorways are we gonna be able to get from Max? Right now, it looks like you're gonna be able to get black and brown and red. There we go. Install properly. It works. It works. Let's try to get a Mac. YouTube, this is not real guns. It's fake. It's airsoft toys. It's seated. It's out. Let's try the other way. Get out. It's a very weird uh, angle to do this in. Get out. You see him? Boom. Works very well. Let's try another Mac, because you guys cannot see. It's just these Macs that work. Let's try with a PTS Mac. Another PTS. Works. Works. Yep. So, clearly, these Macs work very well. It's it looks great. I love the way how this looks. Um, I'm a big fan of uh, Ambi, so I know a lot of people don't like Ambi selector switches, but uh, don't be bad. <laughs> so thank you, Max, for sending these. You're having black, we're having red. I like red the most, obviously, because I like red stuff. But this goes well. Black with black trigger and red with red trigger. I like it. Um, but um, I tested these out for the weekend. And they were absolutely amazing, they worked fine, there was no issues, there was no problems. Um, all magazines fit, I tested with Amoeba, I tested normal MTW Max, everything seemed to work in it, so that's great. So, I don't know when it will be released, or when they will be, or when they will come out, or whatever. But, I can tell you that I will advertise it on my YouTube channel. Probably all my uh, Instagram, all my Discord server, one of them I will come out on. No, I'm not, I don't get paid for this, but it is obviously a sponsored video by Max. So I get sent these things for free to test. Um, but it seems like everything works as you should. Anyways, thank you for watching and uh, see you next time. Peace.